look at those cute piglets. Just a few weeks ago, they first saw the light of day. Since then, they had grown pretty good and are now strong enough to explore their environment. But we will start our journey at the beginning. So hi, we are a little group of students from Germany who wanted to understand how the living pig ends up on our plate. So follow us and meet the meat. Our journey starts with the cute little piglets from the beginning. But to be honest, those animals won't be able to explore much of their environment because they will spend pretty much their entire life inside a pigsty. Why? Only for the consumption. Most of us are eating meat, but the social part of those who refuse meat consumption has been increased for the last decades. The countries with the highest percentage of vegetarians are India, Israel and Taiwan. In Germany, for example, alone 27.2 million pigs are kept for the purpose of meat production, like the little piglets from the beginning. A pig's life starts with its birth. A sow usually gives birth to up to 20 piglets, but a few normally die due to overlaying. To reduce that, the sows are just able to get up and lie down again. But then, after 7 to 8 months, a typical pig's life ends because it reached a slaughter weight of 110 kg. Finally, the last way take them to the butcher. Psst. After the hair, organs and other parts of the pig were removed, the dismantling is the next step. As you can see, the pig is now divided in smaller parts. This makes it easier to sell it to local markets. Look at this huge choice between different meat. But remember, all this is made out of a living pig.